today i am going to teach you plane scale and this is the second problem of the plane scale so welcome to my youtube channel mechanical engineering management and in this video we are going to solve this problem of the plane scale so let's see the description construct a plane scale of rf is equal to 1 is to 50 that means representative fraction to show meters and decimeters and long enough to measure 8 meter indicate 6.7 meter distance on the scale so there are two different tasks first we have to construct the plane scale and then on that plane scale we have to indicate the 6.7 meter distance these are the different units in the ascending order by multiplying 10 so you have to remember this now as we know that rf is equal to drawing size upon actual size and here rf is given to you so i can put the value rf is equal to 1 by 50 is equal to as it is and drawing size so that we are going to find so i can write here lod means length of drawing upon actual size so here you can see scale should be long enough to measure 8 meters that means actual size of the object is 8 meter so you can say the maximum actual size of the object is 8 meter if i simplify this relation then i can find the length of drawing that is 1 by 15 to 8 meter then you will get 0.16 meter now once again you know that 1 meter is equal to now once again you know that 1 meter is equal to 10 raised to 3 mm so that length of drawing is equal to 160 mm once again if you divide mm by 10 then you will get 16 centimeter so this is your length of drawing now i can start the plane scale so first of all with the help of this scale draw the line having length 16 centimeter so here you can see 16 centimeter and this is your length of drawing of the scale now you can mention over here the length of drawing is equal to 16 centimeter now take the height of the scale as 1 centimeter and then complete the rectangle now divide this length of drawing that means 16 centimeter into 8 equal parts because of we have to construct the plane scale that is long enough to measure 8 meter so i am going to divide this into the 8 equal parts now give the number and always keep the first division so start from here and move from left to right now with the help of the roller scale you have to draw the vertical line passing through these all points so here you can understand exactly the application of the roller scale and definitely you have to follow the same procedure in the examination also so simply we can draw the parallel lines with the help of the roller scale now you know that this each division represent as one meter so that you can understand this scale is capable to measure maximum distance 8 meter so you can say this is the scale that we have written in meter now divide the first division into the 10 equal part and you know that this one division represent as one meter and if you divide in 10 division so here you can see if one meter is divided by 10 then you will get decimeter so each division represent as one decimeter so i can write over here 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so it is not required to write each and every division because of space is not available so this division represent as decimeter so you can say this is the scale that is ready to measure up to 8 meter so this is your first answer construct a plane scale 
now second one indicate 6.7 meter distance on the scale so here you can see 6 meter and 0 0.7 that means 7 decimeter so here 6.7 means 6 meter and 7 decimeter so here 6 meter and 7 decimeter so this is 5 decimeter then 6 and then 7 so i can draw from here to here 6 meter and 7 decimeter so this distance represent as 6.7 meter so indirectly you can say this distance is 6 meter and 7 decimeter if you want to see more engineering videos then subscribe my youtube channel and go to playlist thanks my dear friends press the like button to appreciate this video